Oxygen factories in India are being pushed to their limits as overwhelmed hospitals begged for oxygen supplies on Saturday. The country's coronavirus infections have soared in what is being described as a tsunami by the Delhi High Court, setting a world record for cases for a third consecutive day. In Lucknow, the capital of India's most populous state, Uttar Pradesh, queues snaked around the corner at oxygen factories with people holding empty cylinders, hoping to fill them up with oxygen for patients. At a nearby hospital, staff member Amit Verma told reporters that the situation was desperate. Only three cylinders are left and four have expired. You can see for yourself if you don't believe me. There are bodies lying in the hospital and this whole truck is filled with empty cylinders. The Indian government had itself declared it had beaten the coronavirus in February when new cases fell to all-time lows. However, health experts say the country became complacent as the government lifted restrictions that allowed big social gatherings and political rallies. Meanwhile, the Indian government has asked Twitter to take down dozens of tweets, including some by local lawmakers, that were critical of India's handling of the outbreak. Twitter responded and withheld some of the tweets as the government made a legal request to the company. It followed the government's emergency order to censor the tweets. India has hit a rate of one COVID-19 death in just under every four minutes in Delhi as the capital's underfunded health system buckles. The government has deployed military planes and trains to get oxygen to Delhi from the far corners of the country and overseas, including Singapore.